How's it going guys? Washed up nobody here and I apologize in advance. I caught a flu, don't know how, but if I sound a little nasally, that's why. Anywho, today I have a mystery box from eBay. Long story about this, originally bought this at the end of January, you know, around the 20th of January, I think 24th to be precise. Um, yeah, OzPost stole my original package. They stole my original package. I got in contact with the seller and they apologized, even though it wasn't their fault, that the package was stolen. So they offered to just send me another one. So thanks to the seller. Uh, I'm kind of excited to see what's in here. So I guess might as well get to it. Okay, so here we are. The box in question. Time to open it. I will be changing the camera angle back to the regular camera angle once we get to the packs inside. Because there are packs inside. But I want to see what else is in here. So let's see. Uh, so starting off, we got some bubble wrap, as always. Oh, whoa, this is actually a mystery mystery. Hold up. Everything's wrapped. That feels heavy. Obviously, this is going to be the packs. Um, yeah, okay. So, just so you guys know, this is a $70 mystery box for these. These might be... I don't know, that, that's, a, that's a top loader, definitely. There's some stuff in here. Hmm. I wonder if it's going to be worth $70. I guess the only thing we can do is wait and see. So I'm going to switch the camera angle back, and then we're going to get into it. Okay, everything's in position. We have the camera. We have the packages. I think we should start off with this one. So let's get right into it, shall we? Hopefully that was deep enough. Oh, I didn't even need to cut the... I wonder what is going to be in here. Ooh, we got a Fusion Strike protective case by looking at it. Oh, it looks like a few actually. Hold up. It is a actual proper top deck, like it's like the card sleep protector. I'm very interested to see what's it. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Okay, there's... Huh. I'm guessing there are multiple in here? That's very confusing, getting two of these. Um... I guess we'll go right into this then. Put that over there for a sec. Oh, okay. So, oh, okay. So there's two. All right. So, um, what's the easiest way to? Oh, there's three. Okay, surprise. All right. So we'll start off with because obviously this one is like the best out of them. So I guess we'll look at this one first. Ooh, ooh. We got a fucking what is that? Is this a Vista? Is that a no? It's just a V Max. Wait a minute. What are we looking at here? What are we looking at? Camera focus? It is just a VMAX. My champ VMAX. That's still cool. I'll take that. First card is a VMAX. Very nice. Okay, so what's the next one? Ooh. Ooh. Trainer Gallery Rose Raid. Very nice. Trainer or Galarian? Uh, I think it's Trainer. Yeah, Trainer Gallery. So if... Okay, so if these two are just like... The air cards, and this is the good card? Ooh. Ooh, it's a Dragonite. It's a Dragonite from the Pokemon Go series. The uh, the side down here is a little, a little, you know, it, it could be just the, I gotta check the card now. I gotta check the card. Okay, it is just the, it is just the, just the sleeve. I'm gonna keep it in the sleeve. That's cool. I got the Dragon Eye. I think I needed this one. Although it doesn't say it is... Wait, is it from the Go series? Wait a minute, let me get... Yeah, it is. It's from the Pokemon Go series. Okay. Okay, Pokemon Go Dragon Eye V. Very nice. So, very nice cards indeed for the for the free hit cards as they're labeled as. So we got... I don't know. If we were to order them, it would definitely be... Oh, wait. No, because it's... VMAX are like the, the top tier cards, but still a Dragon Eye. Still very nice. Okay. So um, I'm going to put those over to the side. See, this one's got some weight to it. So I want to see what's in that last. We'll go through here first. We'll go through this one. We'll go through this one. Ooh, hello. Oh, okay. Is this like a gift? Yo. Okay. 
Ooh, we got some trade. We got some code cards. Okay, and we also got like candy. Whizfizz. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Okay, I'll put that to the side. Um, now I am keeping the code cards. I've stated many times. Let me just uh. Okay, it opens up like that. Uh, how many code cards is it? Whoa, there's a lot of code cards. Holy shit. That's a lot of code cards. Oh, we might be back on track for the fucking Pokemon TCG uh, unboxing. Celebration, celebrations, Darkness Ablaze, celebrations, Evolving Skies, Pikachu and Zekrom GX Premium Collection. Oh, I want to get that one so bad. We got a Sword and Shield Battle Styles. We got a Battle Style, no, uh, Brilliant Stars. We got a Fusion Strike. We got a Fusion Strike and Brilliant Stars. That is going to help me rebuild my digital code collection after moving from online to um, online to Pokemon Live. Which I'm, I'm just going to say, I hate Pokemon Live. Okay, we also got some stickers. We got a Psyduck and we got uh, Latios. These are actually stickers that you can just get off of eBay, not gonna lie. And then we got the premium coin. Is that on the Charizard? Oh, it is the Charizard. You can't even see it that well. Wait a minute, let me just see if I can position. Okay, so this is which way it's meant to go. It's the full metal Charizard coin. This is from a $250 box. I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of eyeing off this coin, the the box. I don't even know if I've got it the right way. Wait a minute, let me look at it again. I can't tell, it's so shiny. Okay, there we go. That is a super nice coin. And if I do get into Pokemon TCG tournaments, I'm using this coin. Um, and also, final things we got, we just got some sleeves from that same box. We got some sleeves from the Charizard Premium Box. Look how nice those sleeves are. I might just move all my Charizard cards into this, because I've got three Charizard cards, I'm pretty sure. Like, three top-tier ones. I've got the Radiant Charizard, and then I've got a Holographic Charizard. And then I think I might have a Reverse Charizard, I don't remember. But these sleeves... Oh, I got four! Okay, more surprises. Wow, okay, cool. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Crash Bandicoot, wow. So, I want to... Th this is heavy. This is heavy. This is meant to have... I'm pretty sure the seller stated on the eBay page that there are free boosters. Now, I don't know if she threw in more because of what happened. Like, as an apology, she really didn't have to. Ooh. No way. How many are in here? Wait, this is way more than what... What? There's only meant to be three boosters. Does she like throw in more? Cause as an apology? One, two, three, four, five. I don't know if she threw in more as an apology or cause she removed the $70 booster or the $70 mystery box off of her eBay page. Um, which made me think she sold out of them. You know, that, that's it, I, I bought the last one. Did she like upgrade me for free to like a bigger Box? I don't know. But I very much appreciate all this. What have we got? So we've got a Lost Origins. We've got an Astral Radiance. Fusion Strike, Fusion Strike, Fusion Strike. <coughs> Apologies, again. Flu. Um, these packs feel heavy. Like, wow, these feel heavy. I don't know where these packs are from. Uh, if they're from a booster box? They feel incredible. I'm going to start off with the fusions, and then I'll finish off with Lost Origin. Lost Origin will be the last one. This has been incredible. Like, oh, this has been amazing. Immaculate. Immaculate. I don't know if she upgraded me for free, or what. Alright. Let's get into some packs. What card is... What way is the card facing? I don't know what this means. I say I do, but I keep forgetting, so we're just going to put that over there with the rest. One, two, three, four. All right. Let's see what we get. We're starting off with a Water Energy. Moving into a Cross Switcher. Garbodor. We have a Marsh, marsh Stomp. We have a Chansey. 
Galarian Zigzagoon. We have a Mankey. We have a Clauncher. Growlithe. Reverse Hollow Sydney. And we have a Holographic Starmie. Nice. Starting off with a Holographic. And let me move some stuff around real quick. I'm very interested in these. These are, what are these? Ace? Is that the company that makes these sleeves? Ace sleeves? These are two different sleeves. Okay. Two different sleeves entirely. Two different companies. So let's put the star, holographic star me in there. Okay, let's put all these to the side. I need to get like more storage for my Pokemon cards. I'm running out of storage. I've been collecting way too many cards as it is lately. All right, pack number pack number two. Um, the Fusion Strike. I didn't get to open that many Fusion Strikes. I got into Pokemon after Fusion Strike. I don't know when I came in. I came in at the tail end of Go, by the looks of it. So pretty much at the end of this Sword and Shield era. Oh no, a white card. One, two, three, four. Could still get. A trainer gallery? I don't know when trainer galleries came into it. Did trainer galleries come in during this generation? Alright, starting off we have a Dark Energy. We have a Pangora, who looks kind of thin there. We have a Graplock. We have a Diggersby. We have Tianamo. <coughs> Galarian Meowth. We have Gossiflo. This looks like the same art that was used for the McDonald's cards. We have a Panpour. We have an Eevee, Veneri, Reverse Hollow, and to finish it off, we have an Arcanine. Please give me a Hollow of this bad boy. I would love a Hollow Arcanine. Oh, right. That's crazy. You're only meant to get free boosters, but I got five. I don't know if it was an apology or, or if the seller upgraded me to a bigger one. I don't know, but I appreciate it nonetheless. Did that go all the way through? Yes, it did. Oh, no. That's a white code card again. Oh, no. White code cards. One. Is there damage on that? No, it's just a bit of... One, two, three, four. All right, so dark energy again. All right. Going into a Simiseer. We have a uh, Farewell Bell. Galarian Lanoon. Snorlax. Snom. Dreppy, Makuhita, Rookie D, Reverse Hollow Elder Goss, and then finish it off, we have a golem. Just a golem. I mean, we got a Starmie. So, you know, no complaints there. Plus, like, the hit cards? And, like, the Charizard coin? Oh, boy. Lost Origin, Astral Radiance. I would love to get the Desa, do I? I'm not gonna lie. I have seen the Desa Do I V Star card. That'd be pretty neat to get. I don't know what packs these are from, because they feel different than the other packs that I bought, like loose boosters. <coughs> and also, like collection boosters. They feel different. Alright, what color? White code card again. Damn. I'm getting hit with white code cards. My luck with Pokemon packs is being. Quite bad, to be honest. One, two, three, four. Maybe we could get a tra trainer gallery. Dark again. All right. What? Whatever. Dark energy. We have a Hisuian Qu Quiverquill, Kamado, Noctowl, Glamiao, Yanma. We have Nicket. We have Swinub, Petalil, Reverse Hollow Yanma, and to finish it off. We have a Ursa Luna. First it's a Luna card. Okay, cool. We got our first ever Ursa Luna. Alright, Lost Origins. Where are we gonna go? Where are we gonna go here? Where are we gonna go? Are we gonna get a colored code card? No! It's white. They're all white code cards. Damn. Even with mystery boxes, I have no luck. Two, three, four. Maybe a trainer gallery. We have Steel Energy. We have Rhydon. We have Kamala. 
We have Roserade. We have Licky Tongue. Clefairy. Wormpool. Murkrow. Binacle. Reverse Hollow Chandler. And then to finish it off, we got a Polyrath. Damn. Even though we got extra cards, we got no big hits. The only hit we got was a Starmie Holographic. But, you know, we got these. And then we got the Charizard coin, which isn't focusing, because, of course, it's metallic and reflective. And then we also got the Charizard sleeve. So, like, I can't really complain too much. For that being said, that is a wrap on the Pokemon Mystery Box from eBay. Let me know in the comments if you guys thought it was worth it or not. I definitely want to try some more. I want to look from other sellers, maybe even actual pages that are official sellers, not just official sellers, but like actual web pages like Gameology, Cherry Collectibles, Pokebox. There's a whole range of places in Melbourne alone that I'd want to try their mystery boxes. So let me guys know if you want to see more of this. But until then, I will see you guys in the next one.